Hello everyone. This video will uh, show you how to create interactive widgets for PLOS in Jupyter Notebook. Uh, the easiest way to get started with uh, interactive widgets for PLOT is using IPython's widgets called IPy widgets. Uh, if you are an account user, uh, this package uh, uh, normally was uh, has been uh, already uh, installed in in, uh, in your PC, um, but you can try by import IPy widgets as a widgets. Uh, let's run it. If there's no error, that means um, it was. Uh, uh, um, installed in your uh, PC. Otherwise, you can install it by pip pip install ipy widgets. If you are conda user um, or mini conda or anaconda, you can install by conda install uh, dash c conda hyphen forge ipy widgets. Normally, if you install this package, uh, the IPy widgets uh, notebook extension uh, already been enabled. But uh, for an older version of a Jupyter notebook uh, that you install, the IPy widgets notebook extension is uh, manually enabled uh, by. Uh, the following command uh, Jupyter NB extension enable dash dash pi widgets NB extension. Yeah, you just run this command, then the IPy widgets notebook uh, extension. Uh, has been uh, enabled. Uh, the methods of interactive widgets for plus um, you already have uh, five. Uh, I classify it into five methods. Um, here we uh, take the following standard sign v function uh, with three arguments for instance here y x is a sin uh, 2 pi f x uh, plus uh, phi a is amplitude uh, f is frequency uh, phi is oscillation the first method is interactive function um, interact function uh, provide you automatically create user interface control for interactive uh, interactive data exploration and visualization. We let's do by uh, import uh, here mistake. Import numpy as mp. Import matplotlib dot pi plot as plt from ipy widgets. Import interact uh, the fu this function interact function. Then we define uh, the uh, same uh, view uh, plot. Uh, we use the name same view or same plot. Uh, any, any name that you like. Here's A, F, uh, phi, uh, three arguments. Then we set up plot. A uh, figure X, we use a PLT subplot method. Um, here, the figure size. Yeah, we already learned all this uh, in previous section. Uh, six four. We set the y 
limitation is uh, is minus four uh, to four. We also use grid. Uh, we set it to true. Then we generate x value. X is NP line space zero uh, two multiply multiply NP P, uh, pi. Uh, we produce one hundred values. Y is the uh, sine wave curve. Yeah. Then we plot x y. We call the interactor function. Yeah, the same view, uh, this function we, we defined as one argument. Then A, uh, A is 0 to 4. Uh, this is a step, uh, it's 0 0.1. F is from 0 to 10. The step is 1 here. Uh, phi, uh, for example, we uh, from 0 to 2 with steps 0 0.5 let's run this let's run yep you see here's the uh, interact uh, interactive widgets you can slide this thing F for example the phi yeah. Uh, we can fix uh, the arguments. F for example, if we want to fix one or more arguments, we import the fixed method from IPy widgets. Import not only the interact but also the fixed. For example, we call interactive. Uh, we uh, you pass fix six for phi to hold it fixed at a value of six. Uh, we do uh, as follows: interact, interact, a uh, same v a the same f the same phi is equal to fixed six. Let's try. You see, here's the the fee is fixed at six. Then there's only a and f. Uh, the slide bar. Uh, we can also create a drop down menu. Uh, we can do this. Here's the scene. Uh, for example, we add a color. We choose the color uh, for the uh, line. There's a color here. We plot, then we add color here. We name color list is color. For example, uh, we have blue, red, orange. Then when we uh, call interact, we add color. Yeah at the end for example color is colors this list let's write <coughs> then you see we have add a color uh, uh, drop down menu we can choose here's a blue then we choose red for example orange you see it's very convenient we also uh, pa uh, can pass a list um, pair pairs like label value uh, to the drop down menus. For example, A, we name one is one, two is two, three is three. Then interactive, yeah, the same. Let's try and see the result. Yeah, here, no, you can see we can choose one, two, or three. The color are the same. Uh, we can also pass a dictionary instead of the list pair uh, above, like this. A is one, is one. 
yeah, two, two, three, then three, the dictionary. Then we call the function interact. Yeah, the same, the same results. Uh, the second method is that we use interact as a uh, decorator. Yeah, is at interact, we put a, f, a f, a, uh, for example, we fixed, then color list is here, then we define the function. Yeah, if we run this, we can get the same result. Yeah. Another method is we use interactive function. I like the interact. Interactive returns widgets instance rather than automatically display the widgets. Interactively is useful when you need reuse the widgets. Let's see the example. Then we first import the interactive from IPy widgets import interactive. From IPython uh, display import display. Then we define the same, define the design function, sign view, AFA, three argument, yeah, the same. You see, this is all the same. Uh, but the difference here, we name, uh, for example, same plot is interactive, yeah, interactive function, same view, a is 0, 4, yeah, the same. Just use the interactive uh, function. We write it, write it. So nothing um, uh, dis uh, is being displayed, but when we need, we can use display, same plot. Then we get the same results. Uh, the fourth method is we use an interactive menu. Uh, in this method, a button is added to interact control, uh, which allows you to trigger an uh, executive event when you need. Let's see the example. Import iPad widgets as widgets, for example. Uh, here is, uh, in fact, is unnecessary. This is unnecessary. Uh, let's call me. We just import from iPad widgets, import. Uh, here, I think we just import, we use fixed. We use, I think we can delete this. We just uh, leave fixed interact menu. The difference here, interact menu, then all the arguments. Let's write. You see, here's this button. If we need to show the results, we just click this run interact. You see, then we get the plot. Yeah, we, we choose, then run, then it, this plot will be changed. This method is very useful with a long-lasting computation that sh should not run every time a widget value change, changes. The fifth method is the interact manual uh, decorator. Yeah, we. That means uh, the interact manual also can be worked as a decorator. Uh, I, here I re um, regard this as a, a method, as a, the fifth method. We are at interact manual. Yeah, this is all arguments. For example, yeah, here we also added the color. Then define same view 
colors yeah af fade yeah the same then we write right interact for example we choose red run oh it not change why oh because here we should write uh, color the colors yeah color We write again. Then, for example, we choose red. Yeah, the chain. Yeah, don't forget here. Uh, yeah, the colors. Uh, that's the video today. Thank you for watching. If you have any question, please leave me a message. Thank you.